Hi guys and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to repair a corrupted sparse or DMG image on your Mac OS X system. Today I woke up and found one of my images corrupted, so after fixing I thought why not show you guys how to do the same. So here's the vid. Cracky. So it's um, 8.28 in the morning, I've finished repairing my sparse disk image which contained my iMovie library so obviously I was a bit worried about that. Um, I didn't record myself doing it as I wasn't thinking I was going to make a video from it. Um, but I cut and paste the terminal commands into Photoshop and put together as best I can a video showing you how to do it. Sorry it's not live but I'm sure this guide will do. So this is the type of warning you'll get when you try and open your file. Um, this isn't actually the one I had, it's an image I found online. But um, it'll say that you've got no mountable file systems. So to fix this, we're gonna to have to do a little work in terminal. So open terminal, and then you're gonna to have to type the following command. HDRutil space attach space hyphen no mount space hyphen no verify space hyphen no auto fsck space hyphen read write space forward slash volumes forward slash and then the next bit where I've got YouTube forward slash iMovie dot sparse image that's the location on my computer where my image was um, I've underlined that in red so the bit underlined in red that's where you put the location of where your sparse image resides on your computer so Hit enter and then you should see a readout that looks a little bit similar to what you see here. So now we actually need to mount the disk image, so we need to run the following command. fsck underscore hfs space hyphen drfy space forward slash deb forward slash and now the next bit here where the, I've got on the screen disk one s one that will depend on what you got with um, the last command. So here's the output of the command. Apple HFS is what you're looking for. You can see that's on the same line here as the forward slash dev forward slash disk one S1. See the disk one S1, that may be different on yours. So whatever you see next to the Apple HFS, um, that's what you need to put in the command above. So then press enter and let the command run and hopefully you should see something similar to what you can see here. Um, and what you're looking for is at the bottom, it should say successfully repaired. And finally, we just need to unmount the disc. So just type hdiutil space detach space forward slash dev forward slash disc one S one. If you had the same output I did, um, if you didn't, obviously the disk one S1 will be the same as in the previous step. Press enter and you should see disk unmounted and disk ejected. Um, now your image is ready to use. Um, if you found that useful guys, I'd really appreciate a like. Um, and if you want to see more videos from me, then please hit subscribe and have a great day.